morning. Welcome to another video. And today we're thinning out this woodland. Uh, there's three of us on site. There's um, me, Finn and Jordan. Uh, basically this woodland's got a bit overgrown. We're going to tidy up, uh, clear out some of the, the dead stuff on the ground. There's also it's primarily ash trees. Uh, a lot of them have got ash dieback. So we're taking those out which will make obviously a big impact on the woodland. Just get it all cleaned up and just tidy up a bit and use the wood chip on the path, create a new, a new path. We're also, it's a good opportunity to get some felling done as well, because there's a lot of trees that were felling. We're going to try and get these two doing the majority of the felling and uh, just try a few techniques and different things, so film this and see how we get on. Very good. Thinning a woodland is something we, we don't do that, I don't do that often really, um, but it is obviously a regular practice within forestry and, and if you've got small woodlands or well, even large forests, you're kind of looking at getting rid of the dead and diseased trees, any like, or clearing up all the forest floor so all the, the dead matter on the floor. Um, if you obviously want like a supernatural, like letting nature take course, then you wouldn't even bother, you just leave it as it is. But this one in particular is going to be uh, there's going to be kids knocking about in this in here, and uh, we want to get rid of any dangerous branches. And like I said this, uh, earlier on this morning, we've got um, uh, they've got a lot of primarily, primarily um, ash trees, and there's a few of them got ash dieback, so it makes sense to kind of get rid of them now, really, while we're here, um, chipping it all back onto the forest floor, and then. Uh, yeah, it's just going to bring more light in. All the more uh, desirable species of trees are obviously going to going to thrive because we're taking out the, the less desirable ones and clearing up all the dead matter. But naturally, that's going to obviously ruin some habitats. But also, we're going to be creating some habitats. And then um, once once this clearance is done and the thinning's done, we're going to be uh, replanting as well, which is good. So we'll be able to put in various types of trees as opposed to just having all ash trees in here. Thank you. 